When doing contingency table analysis or looking at a cross tabulation of two attributes, the first step involves looking at the observed cell frequencies. Once you've done that, then the typical analysis involves looking at a table of total percents. And that table is presented here as table two. The entries in that table, the numbers in that table, reflect what percent of cases fall within given uh, categories, joint categories of uh, these two variables. So for, for example, if you look in the first category there for under the category of city and non-victim, you see that 36% of the sample falls in that category, meaning that 36% of the people in the sample were a non-victim of a crime and lived in the city. Likewise, you see the very few people were rural folks that uh, were victims of a crime. In fact, only 4% of the people were in that category. So this table of total percents gives us basically the overall distribution of cases in our particular sample. And it's standardized by taking the number of observations in the cell, divide that by the total number of observations in the sample. So in the case of city non-victims, it's 500 divided by 1400, which gives us 36%.